Morning people, this video is about uh, going to meet a customer, uh, about a quote. Make sure that you rock up on time. That's not a good look that you set a time and you rocked up late. Okay, <clears throat> so you've met the customer, you got to run th through a few things that they want you to do, even if it is just the lawn. And they'll tell you, oh, I want this done and I want that done. And you oh, okay. And you say, what about the edges? And they might say, oh, no, no, don't leave, don't need the edges to be done. And what I say to that was, well, if you don't want the edges done, you'll have to find someone else because I always do the edges. And sometimes they'll come back to me and say, well, you know, the edges aren't a big deal. And I say, well, they are to me. Because when you have people around here and they go, oh, you get some guy to do your lawn. And they'll go, yep. And they'll say, oh, he doesn't do a good job. He doesn't do the edges. That's the reason I like the edges to be done. Nice, neat and tidy. Once you've gone through about the job, then it's up to you to explain to the customer how you work. For me, it's every fortnight, except for June, July and August, which is the coldest and wettest months in Auckland. And then every three weeks in those three months like clockwork and then you got to say about the payment for me they have seven days to pay they can either pay cash which is fine or you can send them an email with an invoice and then they can pay it into your bank account also, when you're pricing the job, you always have a minimum rate. That's your starting point. And then once you look at the job, you can work out if it's a little bit more or a fair bit more, depending on the job. But also what you've got to take into account is that you've got to put GST on it. In New Zealand, 15%. Because the old tax man, they want their cut. But they're not cutting the lawn. They only want their cut. So 15% GST, make sure that's on the price. And also tell that to the customer. So here's a quick example. Just say you're looking at a lawn, 40 bucks. You know, so GST... Is 46 and you say it to them 40 plus GST 46 so they know instead of just saying 46 say 40 plus GST and let it go like that if they say to you oh 40 plus GST but the last guy was only 35 with no GST. And you go, that's fine. That's his business. This is my business. And then you can also say is, where is the last guy? Where is he? You know, why are you ringing me? Also, ask that question. Who used to do the property before? I came along to do a quote. They might say themselves. They might say it was another operator. If it was another operator, say, What's up? Where's he gone? Then you hear the old stories. Ah, oh, he's retired. Ah, oh, he's gone to Australia. Ah, oh, he had to have an operation. And you go, yeah, yeah. 
And I always say, okay, I've heard all of them before. They never say he's a cowboy. Doesn't do a good job. So, that's about it. Uh, but make sure, don't underprice yourself, eh? If you do that, you're not going to be making much money. And if they're going to whinge about the price, just walk away. Why do a job for whatever <laughs> when you can get paid quite well? Make a profit. Pay your GST. Pay the tax man. And put the rest in your pocket. Yeah. Just getting back to quoting that job. I got the job. It's a one-off. Gave her a price. She's happy with it. I said to her, you got to pay me up front, first job. She goes, yep. And I also gave her a price for a regular mo. If I get that, it's okay. But I've got a one-off. When I hopped back in the van, I had another message. Message bank. So I gave it a quick call, and it happens to be less than 600 metres away. So she says, yep, come around. So I popped around. And as I said, I asked the customer what they wanted. She said, this and that, this and that. I went, yeah, gave her a price. And she says, we'll make a time. And I says, do you want me to do the job or not? And she says, oh, uh, I'll get back to you. I says, okay then, that's fine. I says, if you get back to me, it's the price. But if you get back to me in two or three weeks' time, the price goes up because grass grows. I got the feeling you, you, you get to know, to read the play. She's not going to ring back. That's fine. Well, it's only around the corner. Okay, off to the next job. Bye!